Alright, hello everyone, my name is Zahir Khan and welcome to my video. This video will go over the Project Aliza project for my CMP-167 class. The premise of this project is to go over a conversation with a woman named Aliza who was a psychiatric patient in a mental hospital. Alright, so a brief overview of the code. We've got public class, we got the, we got the main we have a while loop right here. This is how it's going to start off with hello, my name is Aliza, as you can see down here. It's going to improv or it's going to prompt you for your name. Then we have the next line right here that'll work after you type in your name, which we'll go on with later on. We have another while loop here. And in this while loop, it's, we're defining our strings in order to classify what we're going to be typing in. Alright, so here we have a bunch of strings in order to represent the user's um, inputs. And then we go down here. Do you want to run the session again? This is the last line that's going to be inputted to where if you say no, then it would just end the session. And it will come out with this line right here. Now we have the statements. And these are the first couple statements that it will prompt you. And if you ask a question, then the code will randomize into one of these. Well, not randomize, but it'll go over to question zero, this first one. Then based on the responses, it'll go down from zero, one, and two. If it's a question mark, that, so the only way that the string question will activate is if there's a question mark added at the end. And if, if this exclamation point is prompted, then it will give you this as long, along with one of the statements. If there's anything else, it will just re-loop to something else. So now we can start it with, and we'll go along with it. Hello, what's that here? Tell me what's on your mind in one sentence. This is where... This line is prompted. We'll go today is Friday. This is just following the criteria that's been given. Today and Friday seem to be on your mind. Let's talk about it. It's prompted down here. So the first word, today, and then the last word is Friday. It is a fantastic day. And that's this statement right here. And if you say something else, it'll prompt statement two, talk more about the first word and the last word. So Friday is fantastic yet again. Yeah, that's where that's prompted. So then why do you why do you want me to talk about Friday? Then you put a question mark. Does why bother you? How about Friday? And then this is where you put no, but with an exclamation point. And that's where it prompts down here, the wow dramatic. And then no and no seem to be on your mind. It's only saying that because you prompted this part right here. Let's talk about it. And then I want to talk about the project. I'm probably CP on your mind and it'll basically repeat until you type exit. Do you want to run the session again? No. And then goodbye. And that's where the project ends. Okay, that's the end of my program for my CMP 167 class. Thank you for watching and see you next time.